four cars are actually a really good one. Uh, I think they have a bunch of screws in them for... Uh, where is it? Ah, oh, just the one screw, actually. Not so good. I thought they were better than that. Fashionable glasses. Ooh. Yes, please. Let's see if the hairdresser is still open. For? I think it's probably a bit late in the day to get a haircut, but we'll just see. Big, loud, full of corrupt officials and brown nosy citizens, but it's home. Yeah, it's too late for a hiccup. Uh, I don't want to use up the carrots yet. Hub flower we can use up. Ah, sorry, Blue. The jig is up. Takahashi told me everything. Web of lies. It's gone. I mean, I bet your name's not even Blue, is it? Miss Nipple. The general's open 24 7. Everyone else may be closed, but Diamond City Surplus is open 24 hours a day. Let's see what you got. Oh, goody. I need those 308s. Uh, 45s. Might start keeping them in case we can afford the sprayed prey. Which is a pretty awesome gun. Spikes are cool. Weapons, you got anything good? That's really nice. I'll wait and see about spray and pray first. Blood pack, always. Most toys are for. I just have a feeling they're exchangeable for something. Fertilizer would be good. Toothpaste. Yeah, you 
can have that for two, two, six. It's fine. Sometimes you gotta wonder, does anyone fight back? Institute has to have enemies, right? What? You mean the railroad? Well, that's a fairy tale, man. They don't exist. Nah, I heard from my cousin. Okay. He knows a guy that works for him. They got a code phrase and everything. Follow the Freedom Trail. The hell is that supposed to mean? You're full of it, and that kind of talk is gonna get you snatched up by the synths. You read the paper? Damn synths, hiding among us. Don't bother, pal. I ain't seen nothing. I ain't heard nothing. <clears throat> You're bothering me. Bothering me? Don't rude. Because I'm not wearing my fancy dress. Not last forever. His ties. Oh, Nick. Something wrong? The bills. Huh. Forget the bills. Another stray coming in from the rain. Rage you're too late. Office is closed. I know you must be busy, but I won't take much of your time, miss. It's important. You're right. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude, but it's just... The detective... He's gone missing. Nikki's missing? <laughs> what has he gotten himself into this time? Don't worry, I can help. Tell me what happened. Nick was working a case. Skinny Malone's gang had kidnapped a young woman, and he tracked them down to their hideout in Park Street Station. There's an old vault down there that they use as a base. I told Nick he was walking into a trap, but he just smiled and walked out the door like he always does. I'll find him. You have my word. Thank you. Nick should be easy to spot. He's always wearing that old hat and trench coat get up. Please hurry. I'd usually do any speech challenge I possibly can, but with Piper uh, watching me, I just really need to go for the good guy options. Cozy. Two to a mattress. Whoa, three to a mattress. That is some creative use of space. You fit fruit is fantastic. People running. I suppose we could stay for the speech. Pipsky, you want to sit with me? Everybody! Everybody! I need everyone's attention. I would like to address the subject that is on everyone's mind. And that is the disgusting article Piper has written. Diamond City Ooh, has stood Jack. united for over 150 years. And what keeps us united are two things. First is the great green guardian behind me, the wall, our protector and our savior from the filth of the outside. And second is our faith and trust in each other, the faith and trust that has given us prosperity, security, an education for every citizen. And while the paper might point their fingers at synths and other ghost stories to drive us apart, we will not betray this sacred trust. Now, I want everyone to hear these next words very carefully. I am not a synth. 
I am the same flesh and blood boy who grew up on these streets, who was born in a shack just down the waterfront to Martha and Patrick McDonough. And I will not abandon my city due to the heinous allegations of the press. God bless this city. God bless the wall. Piece of shit. <laughs> Hey, you say the word. Sorry. Piper, something to say? No, just nothing thought, else for now. I want to okay. comment on the whole thing. Don't touch the paint. Don't worry, I won't. It's okay, Abbott. I got my eye on this one. Good. The wall keeps out the bad guys, so I appreciate you not messing her up none. Thinking you need a little education. Maybe a bit of community service. What do you say? Happy to help out. You see this paint I'm using? Only one place left in the whole Commonwealth you can get it. Hardware Town. Rune store close by to the west. Bring back a can of paint, and it'll be a hundred caps in your pocket. How's that sound? Sounds like... Yes, because Piper's watching Kate me. Retrieval. I'm on it. Much obliged. I'm impressing the crap out of her. Okay, how much do these weigh? Be careful we don't go overboard. Point one, that's alright. About how I think the I used the gland. I, I collected a gland for her, and I think I used it. Yeah, it did. makes the sense. Oh no, we've been hey there. talking about this. Hi remember? there. Are After you here for today's time, free biology shouting, lesson? Me sleeping on the cold floor of the um, lab for three nights. As long as it's free. Why wouldn't it be? Let's get started. Now we all talk about radiation like it's a single thing, but it's actually a term referring to dozens of different ionizing rays. You have X-rays, beta rays, gamma rays, but which one are we most worried about? The one most associated with the big old bombs 200 years ago. Gamma rays. Gamma rays? That's right. Now, gamma rays are bad, really bad. If your body absorbs too much of that kind of radiation, you'll suffer from fatigue, anemia, even death. But some life forms have been living with gamma radiation exposure for two centuries now, and they've adapted. Neat, huh? Yeah, it's great. You are one huge nerd. I, for one, take that as the highest compliment. Science teaches us the lessons we need to survive, now more than ever. Now it's time for the field trip portion of today's lesson. Are you ready? Sign me up. You're gonna go out and find a bloat fly gland. You see, the oversized bloat fly of today evolved from an earlier species of a smaller fly. Radioactive adaptation has resulted in a unique gland that enables it to balance and maintain speed despite its size. So what do you say? Ready to go out and dissect one? Yeah. I do a job, I get paid. Money? Oh. Um... Damn it! About, uh, I was hoping she would. Caps. I was hoping Piper wouldn't mind on this Get one. Get the bloat fly gland. Got it. Remember, bring the gland back in one piece. Oh, and don't chew on it. I one made, of the students got horribly sick because of that mistake. Fine. All right, Piper, I get it. Don't ask for money. <laughs> 